Well, my goodness, they deserve that applause. What a marvellous week they've given us, and what a, I think, you know, a great hour they've given us here tonight. It does make a change from picking up your newspapers and reading about that it's another 25% inflation. I think we'd rather have a week like we've had and read and see pretty girls. Well, the time has come. Let me say, as those girls now crowding off backstage to watch the last five minutes or so, the last three minutes of the contest, they're all crowding back to see which girl is going to become Miss World. The results are being computed. All the markings of those nine judges are put into one great sheet, computed, and they come out with the result itself. And I must say, I don't know if you agree, this year I am sure these girls have given us more of an entertainment here this evening than ever before. And I think uh, they're all backstage, they can all hear us. Let's give them one last round of applause for the lot of them, because they've been a beautiful girl all together from this world. They're back there, backstage, they're listening to that. And I can see over in the far corner two or three people taking a final look at a piece of paper. That piece of paper has now been passed backstage, and that result, I'm told, with a little smile from my friend down there, is now ready. The result is there. Backstage, Annalena Creel, last year's Miss World from South Africa, will be waiting to crown her successor. But let us first of all introduce the presenter of the prizes tonight, the organizer of the Miss World contest. Will you welcome Julia Morley? And the man who has the results of this Silver Jubilee year of Miss World 1975, the chairman of the Miss World organization, Eric Morley. I shall announce the results in reverse order. Fifth, Miss Yugoslavia. And it's 19-year-old student Lydia Velkovska studying literature and languages. Stepping up to the stage to receive a cheque now for 250 pounds and a silver trophy. Fourth, Miss Cuba. <laughs> Look at great joy and deep surprise on her face. 22-year-old Maxi Clark, this is, and she receives a cheque for 500 pounds as well as the silver trophy. Third, Miss United Kingdom. Great delight for Vicky Harris and great delight too here in the Royal Albert Hall for 22-year-old Vicky Harris. She receives a cheque for a thousand pounds. Runner-up to Miss World, Miss Germany. Another very popular decision, the crown falling off. Marina Langner, who's 22. Beautiful woman here, 1,500 pounds she receives. And Miss World 1975 is Miss Puerto Rico. Incredible sensation here at the Albert Hall with Lilia Merced. 18 years old, absolute pandemonium breaking out there. She's overcome with emotion and pushed onto the stage to receive her prize. £3,000 in cash, the Miss World Championship trophy. She gets minimum guaranteed earnings of £10,000 over the next year and also the opportunity to earn another £50,000 during her year as the Silver Jubilee Miss World. Sitting on the throne, and the cape goes on now. Obviously, a little bit flummoxed. And here is the great moment for Wilnelia Merced of Puerto Rico. Receiving the orb and the scepter of office now. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Puerto Rico is now Miss World 1975.